Today I'm at the Austrian tasting. I'm very happy to be at the Austrian tasting. The wines are amazing here. And I'm with uh, Willy Klinger, head of um, Wines of Austria, all the way from Austria, to tell us um, about the DAC wines. Can you tell us the DAC is <laughs> the appellation or the region? What does it exactly stand for? Yeah, it's similar to the AOC system in, in France or the DOC, DOCG in Italy. We have four basic quality wine regions in Austria, more generic ones, Lower Austria, Niederösterreich, Burgenland, Steiermark, Styria, and Vienna. So within those, we have specific regions, the Weinbaugebiete, as we call them, specified regions from Dachau, Einstein, and so on. Yes. And here, well, while we keep the broad variety of wine styles and the, the flexibility for the producer in the generic appellations, Niederösterreich, Burgenland, we have 35 great varieties and many wine styles. We would like to be very specific when it comes to Kernstar, Kampfthal, Weinviertel, uh, Mittelburg. We want the consumer to know that there's a specific wine speaking for that region. This is an education process, this is work in progress, it takes a generation perhaps. We have so far seven of these DAC regions. It started with Grüner Wittliner, obviously, from Weinviertel, the biggest specified region. Weinviertel in, in, the north. in the north of Vienna. Yeah. They have 15,000 hectares, and half of it is Grüner Wittliner, so it's a good reason to focus on the Grüner Wittliner. And this Weinviertel DSC is always a Grüner Wittliner. Yeah. Then on the Danube River, we have a bias between Grüner Wittliner and Riesling, think of a how, which is not yet a DSC, but they first started focusing on Grüner Wittliner and Riesling in Steinfeder, Federschwitz, Maragd. Weight classes. Yeah? yeah. Then came the first Grüner uh, Wettliner uh, and Riesling DSCs. This was Kremstal, Kamptal, and Treisental, the three near the Danube. So, along the Danube, we had then the bias of Riesling and Wettlina, the first three DSC regions, Treisental, Kremstal, and Kamptal. So, they come in Grüner Wett, either Grüner Wettliner or Riesling, in a classic style, which means medium body or reserve style for long ranging. And now we have also uh, red wine appellations like Mittelburgenland. Yes. That's the mid part of the Burgenland, focusing on Blaufränkisch. You know? yeah. Blaufränkisch is a grape that's called Lemberg in Germany. Yeah. It's very focused wines. Great. There was a tasting in New York now where the press really love those terroir wines. So Mittelburgenland, and there's another one, Leiterberg, coming with the online in yeah. September, and Eisenberg in the south. Leitberg is not only a blau French, but it can also be a white wine. Think of a Hermitage Rouge, yeah. a white or a Cotrotti. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, excellent. Thank you very much, really. And best of luck with your message.